the queer voices are getting amplified. But Sri Lanka is in the cusp of legal change. It's much more progress than I thought. Bigger, better solutions. Really happy to participate this event uh, and especially in the, the Pride Month because it's happening in Sri Lanka. But it's it's a really cool thing. Second year, born with pride, online hackathon, amazing proposals, four shortlisted finalists, and now looking for the final winner. The format is really simple and nice which uh, makes it easier for so many people to relate and understand what the important issues are. I'm excited to see what the final participants have in store. Being a trainer for an hour working with, with every group was, was, was a very interesting experience because most of the participants I got to talk to actually come from South Asia. Uh, we were just really proud to represent our idea in such a big platform and we were really happy to be part of this competition and for us we just want to uh, see this idea turn into reality. But I was seeing all these different people, all these different ideas. Like it's been a great journey for us to just come together, put our heads together, work on this full time for at least a couple of days um, and I want to continue that like after this as well. Freedom for people from the queer community is one of the focal interests, of course, of human rights related work within a liberal foundation. So we try really to reach out to all the people in order uh, to bring them together, to build a platform of interaction and uh, to give them the opportunity to learn from each other. We will not rest when it comes to building a union of equality. A union where you can be who you are and love who you want. Because being yourself is not ideology, it is your identity. And the coffee table book itself is such a great idea for us to share our stories. Uh, for many of us in our community, we have led a life that is invisible uh, and in hiding. And for a long time, we've been told that our stories are not worth sharing. So there are so many inspiring stories amongst all of us. And I think it's about time we start sharing those stories and inspiring others, not just within our community, but also outside. I believe that this is simply one of the most important topics of our day. The jury process has been quite difficult simply because of the incredible quality of the pitches and the ideas. The winning team is Team Curie. I'm glad to hear that there is movement in Sri Lanka, that there are members of parliament. We met one today. We have to keep fighting, keep fighting for hum human rights. The entire society can be changed with awareness, with the knowledge. And I think it's very exciting, it's very innovative, it's very dynamic. We have come this far, but there is so much more that we have to still go ahead. <laughs>